Hello techies, welcome to AI Brahma YouTube channel. My name is Ganesh. In this video tutorial, we are discussing about Automation Anywhere Basics to Advanced Level. So if you are new to my channel, please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to get first notification to you. In this video, we will learn about how to pass business exception from subtask to main task or child task to main task. So this question is asked by one of my subscriber in Automation Anywhere Error Handling Techniques video. So if you watch this video, definitely you will learn about total error handling like a business exception or normal exception or any other exception, how we can handle it through try, catch, finally, throw and retry. So directly we will go to question asked by Kavita Dawani. She has a one issue in her bot. Like she tried with a business exception passed from child bot to parent bot, but it is not reflected in the parent bot. Means the business exception passed in the child bot, which is not passed into the main bot. That is a issue. How we can resolve this issue? So directly we will see in a automation anywhere workbench. So I have created a two different tasks. One is a main task and another one is a sub task. So we will go to main task. Okay. In the main task, we will take an activity called message box to show where I am, like where the bot is executing. So I am in main task. This will give you the clear understanding of the code. So after that, in the sub task, I will add a message box. I am in sub task. Right? So now we are clear with our logic. So what I will do for this message box, I will add try and catch from the error handler. So if you don't know about the try and catch, please go back and watch my error handling video series. You will definitely get all about error handling in automation anywhere. So just I have added a try and catch. Inside the catch, I will create a error message and here error line number. Both I will add it. Okay. And to show the errors, so what I will do, I will use a message box inside my okay, inside my catch. So you can use it log or you can use it mail to give the information about the error to user, right? So here I will write my error message. Okay, this is the description and where I am getting the error, that particular error line number right error line number dot to string because error line number is in number format so we have to convert into a string format and i will add one more information here because we are doing with a main and subtask activity right so this error line number is in the main task main task error line number just i am giving like this main task error line number or you can add it a error line number that is also fine error line number okay so now you have a error message and error line number same way you will go to subtask and add a try and catch okay, inside the try i will add a, i am in subtask here also i will add message and error line number both into the catch the same way here also we have to add same thing i will copy from main task copy action and here we have to pass it into next subtask means we have to click on the copy shared clipboard and directly have to come here and 
paste it so now sorry you have to paste it from the shell yes so now i have here also error line number and message right both i have so now i need to create one particular business exception right how to create a business exception if you watch my previous videos definitely you will get to know how we can create means we can use a throw right throw action that just drag and drop inside the after the message box and you can write it here testing task bot or subtask anything you can write it okay testing subtask i am giving like this and so just i am saving okay so now i have created a throw inside the catch i have a error message or message something for particularly in this run i will just delete it no issue so now we have created a main task and sub task now i need to call inside the main task this sub task because so issue is whenever we are introducing the particular business exception inside the sub task it is not passing into main task right so that's why we have to call uh, our sub task into main task by using task bot run so after the message box i am just using this one in the control room so wait for load sub task i am taking so i have taken the sub task also so now my logic is completed okay main task is there sub task is there in the main task try catch message box we have added and in the sub task also we have created a business exception right so if i run this bot so now definitely in the sub task we have a error right business error it should show a business error to user that should be in a main task okay so now our bot is executing so first line is i am in main task if i close it so it will go to sub task right i am in sub task now my business exception will run from the throw but my bot is showing as a bot is successfully completed the run right so i am not getting any error as of now or any pop ups right this is the same issue my subscriber also got so how we can re resolve this issue by using sub task to main task activity so inside the sub task just take the error handler throw inside the catch okay and write a error handler message so instead of message box i am using here throw action inside the catch of the sub task okay remember that one error message and error line number error line number dot to string okay both i am passing in the throw error message and error line number here you can write to differentiate so this is sub task sub task error so i am just giving in a bracket okay and unable to give the bracket no issue just i will give a some bracket right so like this i am giving inside the bracket both of the error and same way in the main task also in the message box i will give here main task main task error inside that i need to add a bracket go to next 
and add a bracket so this will give you the clear picture now i will run the main task so now i have added in the sub task one throw activity inside the catch block right so now we will see how the bot will work okay now my bot is started running so i am in main task just closing so i am in sub task now my business logic will work and if you see here main task error it is showing so before it was not showing if you observe the video clearly so that's why don't skip the video please watch till the end you will get a good learning from this video okay you can use it in your current project and don't forget to hit the like button and comment on the video if you comment on the video then only i will get the inspiration to do the videos like this okay please ask the question in comment definitely i will help you so this is a message box we will get like this main task error testing sub task okay 3 line number 3 testing sub task line number 3 error line number is 3 like this we will get it so why i am getting testing sub task right so if you close and stop it if you see here sub task throw here i am writing a business exception called testing sub task so that's why we will get a testing sub task line number 3 because i am adding here sub task error number is 3 right the but i am throwing the error here business exception testing sub task that is passed into the main task i hope clearly you have understand the logic right if you are not clear please watch again the video please don't skip the video till the end okay i hope if you are not clear just message in the comment so definitely i will help you or you if you have any question related to rpa or ai related definitely i will help you and please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel share the channel so happy learning thank you very much